Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Sam Piarly here at Assembly Hall uh, covering the women's basketball team. Just wrapped up their game against Valparaiso, came out victorious 87 to 58. I'm here on behalf of Terry Hutchins' advanced sports writing class and uh, hey, we saw a good overall performance from the Hoosiers today. Um, Alexis Gassian was the top scorer with 19 points. Amanda Cahill picked up a double-double, 16 points and 11 boards for her. Tyra Buss extends her double-digit scoring streak to 47 games with 12 points of her own. Not the best best scoring night for her um, by any means, but still just very effective. Finished with six points. You know She's all over the court. She does everything for this team. And then even Tia Elbert, 10 points off the bench, 5-5 five of five shooting, so very strong performance all around. And this game really started off with the turnovers, forcing turnovers in the first half, and that led to points for Indiana. And uh, Coach Warren was real upset after last game against Northern Kentucky. Indiana actually won that game by 51 points, but she wasn't too happy with the, uh, the defense that they brought and the intensity. They said that their goal going into that game was 35 points, and they gave up 49, and so wasn't too happy about that. Today, she was a little bit more pleased with this, uh, this defensive effort in the first half. Indiana forced 13 turnovers and got 17 points off those turnovers. So that set the tone early, and Gassion was hitting shots from the mid-range. It was just burying it. And just overall, this team has a lot of potential to do great things in the Big Ten. Um, playing here at home is obviously a little bit more comforting, comforting for this team. They went on the road uh, and played at, um, at Western Kentucky, at um, NC State, and at Auburn and lost all three of those. So coming back here, uh, two games straight now, uh, a little bit, you know, feels a little bit more like home comfort for this team. Now, overall, the, we talked about a strong performance, but in the fourth quarter, um, Valparaiso outscored Indiana 26-15, to 15, and Coach Morton was not, none too pleased, really, by her um, team's performance in the fourth quarter. At one point, um, she brought she, she started the, the quarter with all five bench players out there, and then a 10-0 run from Valparaiso quickly led her to bring back in three starters, Gassian, Cahill, and Tyra Buss. And I think she didn't want to do that, and she tried to trust her team into letting her not be able to bring in those players. But they didn't they didn't answer the bell, and she was forced to do that. So this team is really good with their leadership, juniors and senior wise and starters wise. But where it lacks is in the bench, having some inexperienced players. And I think as the season goes on, they'll continue to figure that out. And you know, come tournament time. And Coach Morton said after the game, they said, you know, this team wants to be great. She believes that this team is great. And I I think this team can do great things as well. And so they want to be playing in March. And if they want to be playing in March, they have to be, you know, sound all around with great depth and everything. Starters were strong, you know, four players with in double digits tonight. And just overall, good performance from Indiana. Taking down Valparaiso, 87 to 58. If the bench figures this thing out and where they need to go from there defensively, I think we'll see this team get a lot better as the season goes on. So my name is Zampiarly for Terry Hutchins Sports Class. Um, thanks for watching.